Hello everybody, this is Ziad. Welcome back to another exciting video of Pokemon Fire Red on uh, Z's Gamers Guide to Mobile Reviews. Let's get right into it. We are on the fourth level down into uh, the Rocket Hideout, which is the place where the Team Rocket is um, doing all their good deeds. Max Ether in the item's pocket. Max Ether. And Ether. Anyway guys, I um, if you guys are just um, um, now checking back onto the channel, yeah, we basically just have been playing Pokemon Fire Red on the Game Boy uh, emulator uh, with the uh, My Boy free app. Um, yeah, so that's the name of the app. That's just for info, you know, if you want to get the app as well. Um, but yeah, um, I've got to say the game is very challenging, very exciting. Not so as you play uh, through it, um, you encounter different challenges. Uh, very retro challenges I might add um, we are on the fourth level down so this is the last level of uh, Team Rocket's uh, headquarters so this uh, the fourth level down is the lot basically the last uh, floor uh, into Team Rocket's hideout headquarters I read that um, yeah, on the previous couple of videos, where, um, yeah, from the dialogue boxes, they said that, um, Team Rocket's headquarters, uh, Team Rocket's hideout headquarters is four levels, um, down. Um, for, yeah, so Team Rocket's headquarters, Team Rocket's hideout, Team Rocket, Hideout Headquarter Team Rocket Hideout Headquarters is Yeah, basically it said Team Rocket Hideout Headquarters uh, Are four levels deep And you will encounter The boss On uh, The fourth level down So um, Yeah, that should be exciting Team 49 Yeah, the uploads can get pretty intense We have Taunt, Hyper Beam, Frustration, Secret Power You guys know about Frustration So the user, the less the user likes the trainer The less the user likes the trainer um, The pack grows more powerful I think is what I realized is I think the user might be me and the trainer is like um, the opponent's Pokemon uh, tra uh, the opponent's uh, Pokemon trainer. So that's what I think. I can I think it in I think I understand in that way. What they mean is it goes more powerful the less the user which is I uh, like the opponent's Pokemon trainer. I say they, 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 Queens. Basically, uh, 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 how do I say it restricts, it's restrictive, you know, restrictive moves. And Hyper Beam said it. The user rests on the next turn. Okay, frustration. The frustration move is also like similar in some way to taunt. Uh, you know, it's moves that actually restrict the opponent. It's a restrictive move and it um, really advantageous and really. Yeah, I'm not going to use the rest of the time. 
on the road on the fourth level now I need to not remember what we've got Fury Cutter, Sand Attack, Aerolace and Fury Attack Fury Cutter um, is an attack that um, it basically it, I think it becomes more strong attack that goes strong on each successive hit and it's a bug type attack I think I'm going to use Edel Ace, a flying type attack because I know that I have a feeling this Pokemon is um, vulnerable or this or flying type attacks or this a Poke Pokemon's uh, kill is hero in other words and I just have to finish it off yeah as you guys can see we still have the damage from last time and um, six, 769 speed. Let's just continue with Eagle Ace. Wow. Zuba could have been a real problem there. Choding is getting close to level 27. Oh no, I dropped the lift key. Aha! I'm gonna take it. Let's open the lift key. I've got the lift key guys, I can go ahead and save right here, yes save, overwrite it, what do we have here in our Pokemon team? Okay, um, what we can do is we can go to our bag, um, steals the foe's healing or status changing moves, steals the effects of the foe's healing or status changing moves, wow, that's, that, these are some very special and unique moves, um, Okay guys, I think we should use some potions on our team because our team is not looking too good. Princess elected po uh, po specifically Princess selected moves po uh, power points for one Pokemon. Wow, that's a good one. Max Ether. Most of these items are not going to be used. Oh, it's kind of revive. That is. Got the love key. What does that mean? Where's the boss? Okay, so I just got to this level. Um, uh, before you just stay, I'm just gonna save again. Overwrite. I have to go use the staircase here because it's back where I came from. I'm on the third level now. Um, as you guys saw, baby, the boss is there on the fourth level. B, uh, BF4. It is on that uh, BF4 level, but I have to use. Guess what? I have to go use the elevator. It's the only way to get there. And if there's no staircase, I'm gonna go use the elevator. That's why I got the key. See, I love this game, man. It's very adventurous. You know, you have to figure problems out. It's really cool. I mean, yo, it's frustrating sometimes. I thought now, why are you looking at me? You said that um, Team Rocket's headquarters has four underground floors.
is four underground floors and you will reach the boss on the fourth level okay so continue onwards towards the elevator so the team rocket headquarters definitely has four underground levels The Team Rocket Headquarter has four underground floors. The Team Rocket Headquarter has four underground floors. You will reach the boss on the fourth level. I'm trying to get there right now, but it's a maze as you guys can see, so I'm trying to figure that out. Uh, let me just think. Um, elevator. Oh, there's the elevator. Remember guys, um, I went through this maze and I got down there. And I went to the second level of the review. And I, I, I definitely uh, got to the elevator here somehow, through here somehow. like I'm playing Super Mario where's the elevator I was right it's easier is this side not near it was near this this area I knew um time to go to the four the team rocket headquarters has four underground floors the team, the team rocket headquarters has four underground floors you will reach the boss of this level the Team Rocket Headquarter has four underground floors. You will reach the boss on the fourth level. The Team Rocket Headquarter has four underground floors. You will reach the boss on the fourth level. That was misleading at the beginning, I've got to be honest. Some of the information you encounter, you really have to decipher. Um, it's really, they do give you clues as you go along. But like uh, using the elevator seal, calcium. Oh, status effect. Status effect items. Pokemon state. Pokemon status effect. Hmm, what's it called? I think it's Pokemon, uh, Pokemon uh, status, uh, Pokemon status effect items or something like that. Focus Pokemon status items. Can't remember. It's all coming in one moment. Like I said, okay. Okay. Let's go see. Any cases being Pokemon status is hmm. It's the base special attack set of one Pokemon. This raises base special attack stats of one. This raises the base. This raises calcium. Uh, raises. The base special attack stats for the Pokemon. So these are stated to be Something like that. Okay. This one specifically for... This one specifically raises the base special attack. Uh, this one, this uh, specific item, status effect item, um, raises uh, the base special attack uh, stats of a Pokemon. So that's one Pokemon, whatever Pokemon you use on. Very special attack stats. I'm just thinking now that could be useful. I think. Uh, 
Like I'm gonna throw my eyes. Okay, nothing to help me here. Okay, um, let's go up against these guys. So, Calcium will raise the uh, base special attack stats of one Pokemon. So, whatever Pokemon I choose and I use Calcium on it, um, it will raise those, uh, it will raise those, uh, status, uh, it will ra raise those status. Whatever Pokemon I use, Calcimon will raise uh, its uh, base special attacks. Uh, st uh, st what does it do again? Calcium raises the base uh, special attack uh, stats of one Pokemon, right? Let's just check that out. That could be useful now. So that raises that status uh, effect of a Pokemon. I'm just thinking now, if that raises that um, Pokemon status effect of a uh, if that raises uh, that uh, um, if that raises that specific Pokemon's uh, Hmm, just thinking now. I'm thinking now what Pokemon would I even use calcium on if it raises that status effect or uh, well technically it is a Pokemon status effect I think. Hmm I don't know. If you not done to a Pokemon that I want to raise I would use calcium on a Pokemon in which I would want to raise the base special attack stats uh, um, of that Pokemon. I would want to use calcium on a Pokemon uh, that I would want to raise uh, its base uh, special attack st uh, status effect. Are those states effects? That's what I'm getting. I don't know what that means. States effects. Let's go. Okay, so it's a status, a Pokemon status effect item um, that raises, uh, so it raises the base special attack stats uh, of a Pokemon. I would want to use that on a Pokemon. Uh, that has preferably a lower base special attack stat. I would only use that on a Pokemon in my team that has preferably a low base special attack stat. Yeah, definitely I would want to use Calcium on a Pokemon in my team that has... I would want to use Calcium uh, on a Pokemon my team, preferably with a low base special attack with low base special attack stats. Okay, so which one would be the best? I wanna actually use it now. Okay, so the yes, definitely guys. I would wanna use calcium uh, on a Pokemon my team that has low base special attack stats okay so which one has the lowest base special attack stats 20 36 37 24 what do do? okay clearly it's Paris
it's used counter oh my word unbelievable it took out feathers I would want to use that uh, Pokemon status uh, effect item on a Pokemon on my team that has oh, wait a Ace time. I would want to use uh, cal the Calcium uh, Pokemon status effect item on a Pokemon in my team that has preferably a low base status. Man, is it now? I just okay, okay. Edo Ace is doing uh Edo Ace is effective. I'm just gonna keep with it and not change the course of attack here. Oh man. This is hard. I was poisoned apparently. I would wanna use the calcium uh, Pokemon status effect item uh, on a Pokemon with a preferably low base uh, special attack stat. Definitely guys, definitely. That's the way you want to go about it. Okay, so that will be Paddles. Paddles has the lowest of uh, base special attack stats of all my Pokemon in the team. So, um, Fury Attack. Okay, now that did nothing. Ah, oh come on. Beauty Cutter, Beauty Cutter. Oh, I'm trying to get the, rid of the last of his health here. Beauty Cutter. I would. Uh, uh, yes guys, I would definitely want to use the Calcium Pokemon status effect item on a Pokemon in my team with a preferably low uh, base special attack stats. It can be any Pokemon actually. It doesn't matter if it's the lowest, but as long as it has a low base special attack stats, which uh, Paris has, um, I can show a few other Pokemon too. Actually, Chilling has relatively low as well. Chilling's uh, base special attack uh, stats is also low, so I can use him in Chilling. I think. Uh, Edo Ace. Edo Ace is the strongest attack he's got, and I. Oh my word. Oh my word, no. Okay, I've got no choice but to take him out here. Ah, uh, deplete the power points of AWS. Great. But this is why I gained um, Max Eve and all that move. That move can restore um, power points of a selected attack. Oh, okay. Oh, my word. I'm gonna have to revive him. Even if I use a super potion. Okay, I'll use a super potion on him. That was my move, oh my word. I gotta be strategic, yeah, okay. But... Antidote. Um, I need to revive Paris. Yeah, guys, so, uh, if you count, uh, encounter the... Pokemon in your team. That's why I bought the guys in the first place. I'm not gonna be using it. Okay, good. I was poisoned. Oh no! Another antidote. Oh, 
Oh man, stop poisoning me. Um, okay, uh, you're just gonna poison Jen the whole time then. Uh. So I would want to use calcium. I would want to use the calcium uh, Pokemon status effect item on a Pokemon my team. That is preferably low uh, base special attack stats. Um, that would mean... Either Paris turning is 36, I was 37. Pikachu and Paris is so Paris turning is 36, I was 37. Pikachu, so Paris, Pikachu, Paris, and Pikachu. Okay, um, they, um, Shedding and, uh, Paddis are taking too much damage. I've gotta use Dug Trio now. I've gotta bring in, um, the big guns, the, you know, strong Pokemon. Now. I was poisoned, okay. Rock sliding. It's not very really effective. Okay, here we go, guys. Um, yeah, the video is probably gonna be so around 35 40 minutes, you know, around about the 40 minutes is usually magnitude in. I've got a magnitude in. Because I did some damage. Man, I'm poisoned, I gotta use that today. Okay, wow, well, I thought that that too would do something, but nux. Wow. Sand uh, slash really is. Um, sand slash really inflicts a lot of. Uh, uses. Uh, this poison status uh, effect a lot. Sand slash really uses poison a lot, okay. Really poisons his foes a lot. Sand slash is a dangerous one, so I think I've gotta switch to gloom. Yeah, I think Sand Slash is like, you know, as that, um... Okay, here we go. Yeah, Sand Slash, sand slash is definitely poisoning. Sand Slash is using poison a lot. Um, so I don't think I wanna... Um... Yeah, poison powder, I believe. I can use acid. Hmm, let me see. I don't know what to use. Acid has the most damage, so I'll use acid. Acid. Critical heat. I was trying to poison him too. Not very effective. Oh, he does, he's using poison, yeah, Sand Slash is using poison sting quite often. I'm gonna use Absorb Grass type attack. Not an Acid type attack. I mean, it's not a poison type attack. Oh, nice. Actually getting some HP and stuff. Okay, so Acid wasn't doing much, so... Poison type attacks didn't do much against Sand Slash here, yeah, so I'm using Grass type attacks. It's finishing off again. Hopefully our items can keep us going here. I don't know if it's gonna be able to, so we'll see guys, we'll see it. We'll have to devise new strategies and you know, moving onwards. Oh my. Another foe. Okay, here we go. Grant from Team Rocket. Let's go. Oh my word. Hope we can take him out. Oh, he can 
to the cut head of the thing. It looks like the gloom is very effective against uh, these uh, poison Pokemon. For some reason, the uh, gloom's grass attack absorb. The gloom, the gloom's absorb, which is the grass type attack, is working quite well. Um, but I don't know if it's gonna work against it, guys. Let's see. Let's put him to sleep. Okay. I must play around. I must just play around with the moves until, you know, something works, you know? So, um... Let's use Rock Slide. Rock type attack, let's do it. He woke up! How did you wake up so quick? Glare, oh my god. Oh my word, thank goodness that worked. I'm not sure if we have what it takes to beat these Pokemon. They're quite tough and fine. Okay. okay. Let's use Grand Type Attack. Okay, we know it works. Oh, thank goodness, guys. That was tough. I mean, I wasn't. I was trying to um, um, think of while playing. I'm thinking of uh, different strategies. Or, uh, you know. Oh my word, I missed. I was trying to think of other ways that uh, that uh, well, other ways to win here, but uh, dig. Dig should work? I mean, yeah, it should work. I was thinking of uh, different strategies to use here while I was playing, you know. Okay, Dig worked. Well, Dig doesn't often work sometimes. Think what Pokemon though. Oh my god, oh book. Oh no, please don't. It's not very effective. I think I'll... Not very effective. I'm thinking of using a super potion soon. I'm just trying to see if D is effective against Arbok. Oh wow, one shot to do. Okay, good, nice. You know, guys, we are leading towards the end of the video, you know, we took on multiple uh, Team Rocket uh, uh, Team Rocket opponents here. Uh, it would be a nice idea to save. While I'm at it, I better use items now. I'm not in battle. So guys. I defeated these guys, I'm about to take on the boss guys. 
fingers crossed, I can do it. If I'm about to take the boss on, then I better use items too. There we go. There we go, nice guy. Okay. Now we can say... You guys remember I came out of here? And then, yeah, that was BF4 now. And then I defeated these guys. And then now I'm going onwards to the boss. So I must stay. I am impressed you got here. Team Rocket captures Pokemon from around the world. They are important tools for keeping our criminal enterprise going. I'm the leader. Giovanni. Giovanni. You heard it there guys. Giovanni. Giovanni. For your insolence, you will feel a world of pain. Yeah, I'm, I'm prepared for that, guys. I'm prepared for World of Play now. Well, boss Giovanni would like to battle. He's got three Pokemon. Send out Onyx. Okay, I all know that we all know that I can't really use anything from Parasite or Rest or Count or Cut or Poison Power. Let's just go and get a capable Pokemon here. Doug Trail should be able to do something against Onyx, if I'm not mistaken. You um, magnitude. Let's try. Um, not box slide. Oh, right, right, let's first try box slide. That's what I mean. Giovanni. Ooh. Might be an issue for us. Okay, rock type attack's not working. Oh, I just. Wow, I just used it again, guys. Oh, and these attacks aren't really effective against me. Okay, let's try and win this as quickly as we can. Magnitude. Wow, what is that? We got rage. We went in a rage. I can't move. Are you kidding? Ah. Bind. Oh, man. Come on, do something. Okay, ground type attacks work. I'm gonna use dig, guys. Absolutely use dig. So I can dodge all these moves. Okay, here we go, guys. I have to use dig. I'm on low health. Okay, there we go. Super effective. Paris. Dog player, because Paris is being switched in. Yeah, switched in. in the, Paris is in the main slot. Mm. Two more Pokemon. Come on, guys. We can do this. Let's use a Super Potion. Something tells me this is not going to be easy. Eeks. We are forced to use our items here. Oh, come on. I was it four times. Time to use Dig again. We have to use Dig, guys. Come on, Ryan. Yo, Vani's not making it easy on me. Oh! What a hit! I was right to, to switch to Dark Trio. He's actually doing some damage here. Serious damage. Dig is actually really appropriate to use in this situation. It actually avoids... Um, 
uh, attacks on the second turn so it can avoid it and can attack yeah wow. can make an attack miss it's really you actually take cover on the ground it's actually cool um yeah dig is really uh one of the best to use this type of situations i've got four power points of dig left to use There we go. I'm about to beat the, the boss of the Team Rocket headquarters. Oh. Oh, I have to use Diga. I want to avoid the attack. I'm use Deed. Oh! I have to use Revive now. Guided though, so just switch game quickly. Water Pulse him. Mega Pun. Oh my word, he's using strong attacks. You get my Mega Punch me the whole time. Send out Doug Trio. Come on, do it, Doug Trio. Come on, use Dig. Yo, I'm about to win. Okay, guys, we won the battle, I think. Yeah, Dig is actually the perfect move to use in this situation. Um, you can actually avoid uh, the opponent's attack. You can actually avoid an attack with Dig. It's too cool. Boss Giovanni is defeated. I defeated the boss guys, what this can be? 2900 cash for me. I see that you raise Pokemon with utmost care. A child like you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. I hope we meet again. I hope we don't meet again. Obtain the self scope. If that reminds you of Pokemon times, I put the self scope in the key items pocket. Self scope. Oh, anyway guys, we attained the self scope, we defeated the boss, um, yeah, uh, in Team Rocket's hideout, this is, yeah, amazing, self scope, let's go check out self scope, oh, what, what would it be, key item, where are you, self scope is selected, this isn't the time to use that, okay, I'll paint the soft score. Anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Catch you guys next time on the next video. This is the yard. See you in. Goodbye.